Hello everyone, my name is Nima and today we're going to be talking about glioblastomas. Glioblastomas are one of the most common and aggressive brain tumors. These tumors originate from astrocytes and are typically located in your frontal, parietal, and temporal regions of the brain. Because GBMs can invade surrounding tissue, they're considered cancerous. This makes their treatment a lot more difficult. They typically present with worsening headache, nausea, vomiting, and seizures. To diagnose brain tumors, neurosurgeons have to access the brain, take a sample of the tissue, and send it to pathology for examination. Because this is not feasible at all times, they use a combination of MRI imaging and neurological exam to help them suspect the presence of the brain tumor. The treatment of glioblastomas involves a multidisciplinary team of doctors and other healthcare providers. Because these tumors are very aggressive in their growth, standard of care involves surgical resection followed by cycles of chemotherapy and radiotherapy. In some cases, the brain tumor may be in out of reach or sensitive areas. In those scenarios, the treatment only involves cycles of chemotherapy and radiotherapy. Glioblastomas are a vast area of research. We're going to have a dedicated video on how you can sign up for clinical trials or how you can explore other treatment options such as the TTF. Finally, I do want to touch on palliative care. This is a type of care that you can have side by side of you undergoing surgery or receiving chemo or radiotherapy. It's basically just there as another Another layer of support for you and your family and it's something that you should definitely discuss with your healthcare team. Thank you so much for watching this video everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you in the future videos.